An essential part of all pilots' initial education is survival, evasion, resistance, and escape training, better known as SEER training. Aviano's survival element continues this training with refresher classes for all of its pilots and air crew members. We're stepping missions right now, every day, and any information that I can provide them that's new, lessons learned, I need to give it to them. That way they're going to perform a lot better in a combat situation. During normal training missions, pilots carry a PRC-90 radio in their survival vest. But with Operation Allied Force underway and pilots flying real-world missions, they have upgraded their radios to a Hook 112 version, which has GPS capabilities. The radio is just one piece of equipment pilots use to ensure an effective rescue. They also have gyro jets. The gyro jets, call it Pangon, shoots up to about 1,200 feet. They go down, they shoot up in the air, it ignites. You just pinpoint that location just like that. There's also a survival pack in the aircraft that ejects with the pilot. The vest and pack are both valuable tools, but the knowledge of knowing what could be waiting on the ground for them is even more important. And sometimes you can see a little bit of uh, reassurance in their eyes, but they're, they're so focused right now that every, everything that goes into their, their mission has to be absolutely perfect. So I try to provide the, the most up-to-date information for them. Thanks to the survival element, pilots can take off knowing one way or the other they'll make it home. Airman First Class Noah Park, Air Force News, Aviano Air Base, Italy.